Bonjour. Bonjour. Je m'appelle Sharon. Et je m'appelle Leah. If you're joining us for the first time, this is part of our year-long effort to learn French well enough to read a novel in French. And we're about halfway through the project. Well, are you going to read? Um, uh, well, I guess I have that uh, novel that I found in my backpack. We may not be reading the same thing, but in about six months, we need to read something in French. And so how's it going? It's very hard to say, but I think my French is improving. So for this episode, we are in the Bordeaux and Dordogne region of France in the north of Aquitaine. And after this week, we won't have to be showing stock photos of places that we've never been. Next week, we will be in Gascony and we have photos that we actually took there last year. So we're very excited about that. Wine is the lifeblood of this region, and that's good imagery because about 90% of it is red, and most of that is blended, so forget about varietal labels when you're drinking Bordeaux. Terroir is the key element here, and the primary division is right bank or left bank. A river runs through it. The Gironde estuary is formed from the meeting of the Garonne and Dordogne rivers, and it's the reference point for the right and left. Medoc is left bank, saint Emilion is right. Left bank wines tend to be bold and tannic, perfect for pairing with that steak. The right bank has softer wines, and then there is the entre du mer which is the bit between the two rivers after they fork. That's where you'll typically find the whites, although the area has reds as well. Just a side note, my favorite skincare line comes from this region of France. Caudely was born at the Chateau Smith Haute Lafitte, which is owned by founder Mathilde Thomas's parents. In 1993, Mathilde and her husband Bertrand were helping with the harvest when they met a professor who told them grape seeds have the most powerful antioxidants. A winery has to do something with all those grape seeds, and skin care proved a brilliant idea. For more info on the wines of Bordeaux, see the links on our website. Now for the food. The Southwest is considered by some to have the best food in France. This is the land of duck, foie gras, and truffles. Also, walnuts and prunes are widely featured. To celebrate the Dordogne, we chose two recipes from Paula Wolfert's fabulous masterpiece, The Cooking of Southwest France. First up, chicken legs with grape sauce. This is a super easy dish. It could work as a quick weeknight thing. It uses verju, which is an almost vinegar-like thing some wineries make when thinning the grapes. My bottle came from Black Star Farms near Sutton's Bay, Michigan. To make the chicken, simply braise chicken legs or thighs in a mixture of butter, garlic, wine, stock, and the verju, adding grapes at the end of the cooking. I served it with sarla potatoes, which are thinly sliced potatoes cooked in duck fat and garlic. So good! Those take a little longer than 30 minutes, but not too much more. Recipes are on our website, tufam.com. We hope you enjoyed this episode. Join us next week when we visit Gascony, or La Gascogne. Au revoir. Au revoir. A bientôt. A bientôt.